Hi, honey. I miss you so much. Hi, Mom. I miss you, too. Oh, hey, baby. You call me just in time. I'm just in here making gumbo. I bet you miss my cooking now, don't you? Oh, you know I do, Mama. Hey, Mom. Hi, wait, I look terrible right now. Do we have to screen time? Mom, you look fine. Okay. I was calling because I just wanted to let you know. Mama, I don't want you to get upset. I, I won't be able, able to, to come, come home, home for Christmas, Christmas this year. year. Oh, honey, you do not need to come home for Christmas, okay? I just want you to be safe. Really? Thanks, Mom. Yeah, and I guess since you won't be coming, I'll just throw your stocking in the fire. Mom? I just don't think it's safe. Okay. Let's talk about this later. When? When you've changed your damn mind. That's when you can talk to me coming home. I just don't think it makes sense for me to travel right now. If you don't love me, Marie, just say so. Oh, my God, Mom! I didn't raise a coward. I uh, totally agree about Christmas. But I do need you to come home tonight. There has been an emergency. Because I actually put all your old stuff in bags, and I'll need you to tell me what to donate. So what okay. about your first christening dress? Is the keep or? You know, your mother really misses you, right? I know, Dad. Are you not getting that? I know. I know. Is your heart not working, baby? This is your mother here. I can tell. Oh, my god. Look at that. Your first track meet. Remember how fast you were? How fast you were when you ran away from me halfway across the country to Chicago? And should I get rid of it? Great. We're being safe. We even quarantined in, in different rooms. What? Why? For safety. Hi, sweetie. Your daughter has decided not to come home for Christmas this year. Oh, that's OK. We're going to miss you, pumpkin. No, it's not OK, Ray. Uh, no, it's not okay, and you need to come home. Fine, we will fly to you. Mom, no. Why, it's fine. I will quarantine in the plane bathroom. Great fix, darling. And Daddy will wear his racquetball goggles to keep the virus out of my eyes. How about that? That's not how it works. What if I died in a plane crash? That's a great point. And that was the last thing you said to me. Think about your dead mother. That can't happen if you don't fly on a plane. Oh, my God, the worst has happened. I've had a fall. Mom, I know you didn't fall. You laid down very gingerly. I saw the whole thing. Ray, aren't you going to say anything? We love you unconditionally. No, not that. We love you conditionally? Just tell me what you want me to say, I say it. Are you seeing what you've done here? I hope you're proud of yourself. You guys are insane. I never visited my own mother enough. I guess this is my punishment. And who you want that scene that you can't come home, huh? I know you ain't got no man. Oh, my God. Mom. Your mother and I are being super, super safe. Oh, that's probably Bob. Yep. Excuse me. Who is Bob? Oh, Bob is Sophie's uh, frontline worker husband. Hey, Bob, come in. Get in here. You guys, masks off. We're Can, cool. Please get these people out of your home. And I guess that's why I don't get to have a family for Christmas. I didn't realize okay. how much Calm I like down. to be by myself. Ah! What's happening? All right, honey, honey, listen. We, we are going to miss you, but we're always going to love you. Right here. I love you, too. We still love you, baby. We love you. I miss you, <laughs> but I love you. I love you too, Mom. Would I love you more if you came home? I don't know. Who's to say? <laughs> I'm kidding. I love you.